All the Foo Fighters are good buddies, man. I'm just about to go over to their room and harass them. I don't, I don't know if they're here yet. Probably not. Any Foo's? I've known them for four or five years, I guess. Uh, they gave me a credit on one of their records, and people were telling me, oh, yeah, you play great on that Foo Fighter. Yeah, I go, what? And I looked at the record, and it's just, you know, thanks to Stuart. And I, you know, eventually I ran into uh, Taylor Hawkins, their drummer, who just said, oh, man, I got all my cool stuff from you, dude. Which, of course, he didn't. He's got a lot of cool stuff of his own, but, he, you know. When, I don't really when Stuart told me that, that they were going to do another police tour, because he told me, and like, see, we get a lot of our inside information yeah. through Taylor. Yeah, you know, because I like before still. any of the shit went down, <laughs> I made sure to be. I well, I'd read something like this rumor online that the police are doing a fucking thing, and, and I'd ask Taylor, like, dude, is that true? And he'd go, well, here's what's going on. <laughs> they invited me to a show there one time, so I flew up with them to San Francisco in their jet. Man, I tell you, one of the one of the craziest things that this band has ever done was to bring Stuart on a private jet with us from Los Angeles to New York. Did you hear about that? Did you ever hear about that? And I just got to hang out with them, and they dragged me on stage for one song. We had Stuart come out and play next to you with us, which was super fun. So I got to be kind of like add-on auxiliary Foo Fighter for a day. And then we got on the private plane, and I just kind of sat there and I thought, what the fuck am I doing with my life right now? <laughs> like, just to sit and, and listen to the stories of the band, and that was that was a big moment. That was something that I will never forget, for sure. And I'm jaded, believe me. Yeah, he's seen it all, man. Pretty much. He has seen it all. You've heard of grunge, right? <laughs> that was me. Yeah. I had some shorts I were gonna wear that were like, you know, old yeah. school, like, you Shorty know. Shorty shorts, yeah. 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 And then I had my colored tube socks that I'm having, so. Oh, well, well, well. But I grew up listening to the police, man. And I'm, it's, I'm sorry to say that I've never seen them play. Tonight's the first night I'll ever see the police play. And uh, I'm really looking forward to it. Hello, darling. Oh. Hey, how are you, how man? Are you? Good to see you. Good to see you. Good, good. How you been? Awesome. This, like that, on tour. Hey, you want some lamb? You're not gonna show it to him. No, thanks. I had some problems. Oh, okay. I can't wait. Yeah, me too. I'm excited. Thank you guys. Lamb. Mm. Wish we had lamb. We get fucking hot dogs and fucking potato salad. I feel like you can quite change the level of rock star. That I thought I had until I went in there. Shit. Got a long way to go, huh?